guys. Discount Tools back again with another special buy of the day over at Home Depot. So let's take a look. Nothing. It's I look, took a look already. You know, I got eight hours to go, but a lot of stuff we've seen already. Um, like I said, this impact with the re, with the recip and the flashlight for ninety nine bucks is not bad. Six forty nine. You get a lot of stuff, but it's a lot of money. But it's Ryobi, you know. One eighty nine. I want to say that was one forty nine last week. So price increase. One ninety nine for the kit right here. Six tool combo kit from Ryobi. It's all right. You know, a lot of stuff's all right. One fifty nine. You know, it's not bad. You're getting a four and a charger. 119 for a vacuum and a light and a power source. So saw this already. Seen this already. 109, 269, you know. It's amazing how Ryobi, I think this is brushed anyway. I mean, the Ryobi is, but it's just amazing how, like, Bridget has taken over, like, the, almost like the Ryobi spot with the cheap prices, and Ryobi has increased. So, I don't know. 129, not bad. I think this is brushless. Yep, that's brushless. A half inch hammer drill kit with two batteries, a charger. 99 bucks for uh, a drill driver. Uh, 129 for the uh, circular circuit, six and a quarter. 199, all three of these for the uh, multi tool circular saw and uh, reset. Not bad. 199 for the Two, uh, we've seen this before. It's that's just actually not a bad uh, price, actually, because usually it's two nineteen. I've seen, you know, I've seen it for two nineteen, but one ninety nine for the uh, twelve volt fuel combo kit with the uh, ratchet. Five oh nine. For, uh, I've skipped these. So expensive. I'm pretty sure the hammer drill, like you, you were getting for three ninety nine by itself, on sale. Now you're asking for another two hundred, almost two hundred dollars for, or like a hundred and something for a, a, a multi-tool or a surge. I don't know. I mean, the surge is not bad, but you know what I'm getting at, guys. It just it's it's ridiculous how increased, how crazy these prices are. I wouldn't even get these combo kits unless you definitely, absolutely needed something. Um, four seventy nine. That's pretty cheap, actually. It's been four ninety nine, four eighty nine. It's going down, so I guess they're trying to get rid of them. One eighty nine. Eh, I wouldn't do that. And this is not bad. This I, is this the new one or is this just a Tom? Oh, this is the XR. So this is the XR kit. It's usually one ninety nine, and you're getting a circuit star for fifty bucks extra. So, all right, we've seen this before. Ninety nine bucks for the polisher. The dual action polisher is one fifty nine. 89 bucks for the orbital buffer, 159 for the uh, extended ratchet pads, 279 for the dual bevel uh, motor circuit. Not bad. I mean, if you don't have one or if you ha or in the bridge of platform, that's not a bad price for a battery operated saw. You know, you usually could find a, like what, a Ryobi for 199. 109 for the uh, that's not bad for the oscillating tool. I think we've seen this already, but you know. It's not at all. One sixty nine. That is ridiculous for a six and a. I mean, it's a six and a three. Granted, but I think I'm pretty sure I got it for like ninety nine dollars on sale, uh, or it was a clearance sale. But it used to be. I think one year was one twenty nine. It just you can see the prices going up, up, and up. Again, high speed ratchet and the die grinder for three twenty nine. Not a bad deal because literally it's a hundred, almost a little over a hundred dollars each. This one's not bad either. Four seventy nine. You're getting three. Two, oh, you are getting the high speed ratchet, the right angle impact, the die grinder, and the watch my call it for four seventy nine. Three oh nine. Not bad. It's not bad. It's it could be better. You know. Auger bits. Nineteen ninety seven. Not bad. Six twenty nine. It's that's it's it's corded, but it's not bad. Um, it's dual bevel sliding compound miter saw. Um, for six twenty nine, I mean, the 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 stand alone is is worth the price. Three ninety nine. We've seen this. It's kind of sad because they used to have a ten inch. Now it's eight and a quarter. Fifty bucks for the uh, titanium pilot point drill bit. Oh, wow. I didn't see this this morning, but you got the uh, scroll saw 
uh, from Dremel for 90 bucks, or you got the uh, Multimax with the Dremel kit here uh, for 169 All right, and these are sold out. Sold out. So hand tools. Saw this already, 199 eh. Same thing with the pack out backpack, $89.97. Milwaukee Breaker Bar, 24-inch. That went up in price. That, this morning, I, when I checked it, I didn't get a chance to make the video yet. That was three sixty nine. dollars uh, I mean, thirty six ninety seven. Now it's 50 bucks. Ugh. I mean, it's getting crazy with these price increases. I know. Maybe I, maybe I didn't see it. Maybe I thought it was. I know last week it was that price. And it's just... I'm saying extra 15 bucks this week. Box level, they're always expensive from Milwaukee... Combination here, that's not bad. I mean, usually what the uh, wire strippers are twenty bucks by themselves. So taking twenty bucks out, twenty three ninety seven for the the other two uh, three tools. I mean, the box cutter is usually fifteen bucks by themselves, and that uh, and the uh. 11 and one screwdrivers, you know, like 20 bucks too. So it's not a bad deal. Twenty nine ninety seven, and you're getting the demo screwdrivers here. It's not a bad kit either. I think the demo screwdrivers are like 20 bucks to buy themselves. So it's not a bad kit for the uh, milled face hammer. Twenty nine ninety seven for the DeWalt quarter inch and three eighths drive sockets. Not a bad deal. One sixty nine ninety seven for a hundred and ninety two piece uh, DeWalt set here. It's not bad either. I mean, it could be better, but I think, you know, if it was 99 bucks, I'd be like, yeah, go buy it. But, yeah, it's like all right deals today. 797 no, uh, 69 I mean, that's not bad. Only reason because of the way it's stored. You're already getting the phone case. You're getting the the drawers that can go into your, your pack, uh, your DeWalt top system. I mean, but could you do it yourself? Yeah, you know. Because it's seven ninety seven here, you probably need a deeper tray. I bet you, but it's not bad because you're it's already done. But you could do it yourself. You could get your own Kaizen foam, and if you get the tray, Kaizen foam, and you already have the sockets, you know. But again, it's you got to see how how cheapy they are, and you know this already has a lot of stuff. One seventy nine ninety seven. It's not a bad kit either. I mean, nice to throw in the back of the truck when you need to some tools. Right here, you have seventy five bucks for two trays and two large pack out tool boxes. You know, large pack out tool box. Not bad. Pack out tough system. I'm sorry, tough system. Carbon fiber handle Dewalt for thirty four ninety seven. You know, not bad. Husky level. We've seen this twenty bucks and Stanley Hammer twenty bucks. Not bad. You know, average prices here. It looks like they added some stuff. You got the Crescent Camouflage Shears, twenty nine ninety seven with a bonus pocket knife and Black and Decker Workmate for eighty bucks. And all these were sold out in this morning too. So, all right, guys, that's it for this one. Like, comment, subscribe, and as always, guys, keep on trucking. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.